All right, y'all, this is going to be a quick, short video on how to wire MBS electric fans into your LS swap for pretty much any vehicle, I guess, that you're going to run a Holly Terminator. Um, this is MBS fans out of a 2005 Silverado. It has a, it's a two-wire fan, uh, dual fan setup um, for, so basically, this is exactly how you're going to wire it up. This is for fan number one. 30 on the relay so um it doesn't really matter what kind of relay you have uh you can have a five or four pin but as long as it has numbers 87 um 85 86 and 30 on it the pin should be the same so from pin number 30 on the relay you're going to run it to a 12 volt constant i just got it ran to my battery over here but you can run it to a 12 volt dis distribution block or whatever um pin number 86 you're running it to a 12 uh, volt switched I ran it to the same wire that I ran my red and white wire on my Holly to. Um, so wherever I ran it, that's where I junctioned that in at. So that way when you cut it on, the relay kicks on when the switch is on so it ain't got power all the time. Pin number 87, it's gonna run to the fan, positive. Um, on the ground wire for the fan, I just grounded it to the body here, but you can ground it pretty much anywhere. Make sure that um, whenever you do have these fans wired up that the fan is pulling air not pushing air you want it to pull air and for some reason it's pushing you just want to switch the wires so switch the other wire to the ground and then the other one to the one that runs to uh the relay um and then finally pin number 85 on the relay you want to run it to the gray and yellow wire on the holly i got it hid right here um that's how you wire a one fan set up right here um you can wire two fans as long as your relay will allow it um the only bad thing about running a two fan setup on a one uh one relay is that both fans kick on at the same time if for some reason you want to run the uh, the uh a two fan separate relay setup You'll wire it up exactly like this, but the only thing that changed is where you run it to the holly. So instead of running it to the gray and the yellow on the holly, you'll run it to the gray with a red stripe on the holly. That's for the fan number two output that's already pre-configured in there. Um, and let me show you, I already got this running and wired up. Let me set this on the ground here. change it if you had your fans wired up you just go to outputs you see fan one and number two we're gonna have fan number one kick on when it hits so i'm already at 110 degrees but have it kick on when it's 110 degrees oh gotta do the fan off temperature first two fans off one relay your fan number two will not show that it's going to kick on here because they're wired onto the same thing but if you're running uh, two separate fans i recommend 180 and 175 for fan number one and then for fan number two probably uh, uh 190 and 185 roughly or 
somewhere in there. Any, any of those would be pretty good.